is the type of relationship that I've been searching for, you know, where I'm like, oh my, I'm taking your guys' best interest, you know, when I do things. And like, I want you guys to always know that I'm going to capitalize on your best interest. But if I ever overstep or I do something that you don't, it didn't feel good to you, just tell me, I'll never do it again. I promise. Like, I'm never going to, I'm never going to put you guys, like, I'm never going to violate your boundaries if I know what they are. The boundaries are. So like, if I ever overstep, just tell me, I promise. Like, I have no problem correcting myself. But like, you know, while I'm just going and just like in that flow and I just feel it and I'm honoring you guys, let me do it. Let me show you how beautiful it is. Like, that's what I want. Oh, I'm going to cry again. I'm just like, oh, you, um, that was like, I just, I just want to like honor you, Amanda, though. Like I've never had anybody like honor me like that. Like tell them like, you watch my videos like that just like means so much to me and just are like, you kidding me like, like I just you, like I, for so long I didn't know your messages knew. like kept me going this summer like oh. I, after everything that happened with oh. my like listening to your videos it was like oh yeah like this is why I'm here <laughs> yeah this is why I'm here yeah yeah there's no doubt in that and you need to let go of your insecurities yeah because you pulled me back you're supported your videos really pulled me back too to you know i god used them to pull me back Mm -hmm. to this place to going home you know (laughs) and just how i just don't how willing you are Mm -hmm. you guys don't understand though this like you guys saying that it like wipes away like everything that I've ever experienced. (laughs) Negative. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Do you know what I'm saying? Like, because that doesn't matter. That doesn't matter. Like, that's all I've wanted. So like, that's all I've been fighting so hard to just come out and like go past those insecurities. Stop fighting. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It, but like you I've I mean we've all struggled we've all had a really I mean I've had a, a dark night of the soul life to the yes. point where like, <laughs> what, what are you guys gonna like to the universe or whatever like dark force like what do you what are you gonna do now like you literally think you can bring anything <laughs> that I'm afraid of like you've already done everything like I'm good like if I'm still standing now like there ain't shit no fucking Jazabelle's gonna stand in front of me demonic swinging her little thing try to you get away like get behind me satan not today not today like i've already yes. been the pits of hell exactly. and i'm still surviving you know like i'm thriving we're mm-hmm. thriving we're bringing the light of christ and i'm here to do my father's work and there's not going to be yeah. a fucking demon or anything on this planet that's ever going to stop me from doing that even in my mo- my mother and her devil energy wants to talk shit about me being in the bathroom for five hours like <laughs> no, i'm sorry that like you can either turn down the noise in your house or I'm going to be in the bathroom for five hours because I, it's not about like, I know like religion wants to make us believe that like we have to be so devoted and it loses all it's like connection. Mm-hmm. You know, like me, me going to the, yeah. the Catholic church once and just like the up and down and all of the like rituals, it was like, there was no Christ there. There was no mm-hmm. light there. It, mm-hmm. The place was beautiful. But I'm just like, God, this is so much work for them. Why are they doing it like this? It's not, it's, they're not, it's not right. Like, it's the patriarchy because it makes it into a ritual. But the thing that I want to do is I wanted to go up to that priest and I want to put my hands on him and I wanted to make him feel God. Because Mm -hmm. once you feel God, you don't ever go back to that ritualistic bullshit. You can't. Not when you fucking know the truth. You feel it through every cent- cell of your body. And it's like, mm-hmm. it's not like this is like, I'm dedicated to doing God's work because I've been indoctrinated or some bullshit. It's like, mm-hmm. this is just what I came here for. And like, yep. I, I, it's, there's nothing on this planet. I've, I've walked through um, addiction. I've walked through codependency. I've walked through abuse. I've walked through it all. Every fucked up thing on this planet, I've walked through it. Mm-hmm. And I never lost my center. I never stopped like talking to Jesus. He's never 
in the depths of hell walking in like strip clubs and shit like with all of the sinners quote unquote and i'm laughing having a conversation with jesus he's with me there people are like why are you laughing do you want you really want me to tell you okay so jesus just said blah 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 blah, blah and then they're all laughing <laughs> i brought jesus to strip clubs like I just yeah. wanted- exactly so like <laughs> i don't know i don't know about these sins and it's saints like on this planet like right. i just see the one i just see that we are all brothers and sisters Yep. And however yep. you want to show up, I su- I support people that that are in the light. I don't yep. support people that want to hurt people because they're hurting. But I understand that consciousness. Yep. And I can have compassion mm-hmm. for it. I would never condemn yeah, mm-hmm. you for your actions. I would never, I, even if you want to kill somebody, like, I can still see that you're hurting. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Like, yep. You can see yeah. the the child within. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I guess that's why it's absolute ludicrous and bullshit that I would ever even question it. And that's what I need forgiveness for. Like I need to forgive myself forever, even doubting. But that's the human part of it. That's the part of us being in these bodies that we're still. And I I feel like, and I keep hearing, but I'm not a body. I am free. I'm exactly how God created Mm -hmm. me. Yeah. And But I feel like we were saying that you've, you know, had hard time stepping into the Christ because of the ego. We've all had to deal with that. Mm-hmm. You know, me, me coming out and being like, oh my God, the divine mother in me is awakening. And me going public with that, whew, they came That's with- That's got to take so much courage. That's, they came with they the came- pitchforks. Like oh, you fucking sinner. How dare you say that? Mm-hmm. How dare you? To the point where I, that's why I respect I was like, you so much for being in the spotlight because you know I don't want to be because <laughs> oh man I got lots of people with lots of pitchforks ready to but the thing is is me. like me too I didn't even know that it was wrong for me to say that like I didn't even know of their belief systems for that it was like that's how. not yeah. humble for me to say that like I I didn't say that I was the only one like I didn't say I was mm-hmm. special I just said that the divine mother, the universal mother is waking up within me. And that's what I came here for. Like, so like, I get it. No more world of form. I don't need to claim anything but the Christ. Okay. So so what I was going to say about the ego thing, you saying that it just like, I'm like, I know that's exactly, I rise and then I fall. I rise and then I fall Mm -hmm. because the world comes and I get it. It's a projection of my doubt. And now it's like with you guys, I can stand in my light and know that the moment that I ever wobble, I know Amanda for one is going to come at me first and she's going to be like, excuse me, bitch, check yourself, let you go try again. And I'm going to respect her for that because I know that she has, she's going to capitalize on my best interest and she's thinking about the greatest of all good. And so even if I'm like, my ego is like bruised for a minute, I'm going to go back in the bathroom and have a conversation with Jesus and I'm going to check myself. Mm-hmm. And like, you know, like that's why we when I get, when I get, when me and Amanda go, oh, you know what? The fucking world's fucked up. We might as well just say, blow them up. Fuck them. <laughs> Megan's going to come in and she's going to say something profound. And we're going <laughs> to <laughs> Yeah, she did. You know what? you know what? You're right. We got to save them. You're right. We shouldn't fucking blow them up. You're right. You're right. You're right. Yep. They're, they're not all assholes. That's right. <laughs> That's right. All right. I remember I love them. Okay. Right. I think you nailed our roles. Fucking yes. nailed it. I, I've been seeing it. That's yep. my gift guys. I am the prophet. <laughs> yes. <sighs> yep. <laughs> and then oh, even that like, has oh. so much shame saying that out loud has so much shame mm, that's all gonna go away though yeah okay and like yeah, I, I go i love you i love that you just cried like from <laughs> seeing those insecurities like that's a sign of healing already from being yeah. around us i've been talking for a few hours right all your insecurities are going to go away every fear that you've ever had is going to go away now so <sighs> all of ours yeah because you know you're saying that about me but i i need the same thing too because i need my oh, ego I will. to be checked 
you know I will check yeah. you. Yeah. You yeah. know. Check me. Even if yeah, you have you come swinging, yeah. like I could see yeah. that. I could see it. And you know, I'll just hug you. I'll hug you until you mm-hmm. knock it the fuck off. <laughs> yeah. I will. Yeah. I will. You don't have to be mean about it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But you know what I'm saying? Even if you got super heated, because I know that one thing mm-hmm. you're afraid of is your anger. And you feel, I am. Yeah. You feel like people can't handle your anger. I'm telling you, yep. I don't care if you're swinging. I'm not going to let you leave. Okay. Like I'm, I'm going to really grab you. Know. I'm going to hold you until you That's get it. Really you need to hit me. Yeah. Go ahead. Hit me. I've been hit a million times. It, it doesn't even phase me. Go ahead and hit me. Like get it out. I want you to get it out. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yep. And see yeah. where like my anger isn't towards you. It's it's yeah. I know that, it's, but I know yeah. that. And you have every mm-hmm. right to have that anger. This world yeah. has been cruel. Yeah. Wow, you yeah. really are like Mama Kendra. I know. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, no, it's like uh